Hey guys, 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 long time no talk. It's your girl Herlox here. I have an update today and um, what else I wanted to tell you? There's an update, there's some good news following up from my highlights that I told you about me expecting. <laughs> Why are you guys so quick to jump on the bandwagon of pregnancy? Chick's 40 now, she ain't having no babies. But I have I am expecting something. I'm expecting lots of things, but I'm actually solid solidifying this is a confirmed expectancy, which I'm gonna get into a little further into the video. Um, how have my lots been getting, getting on? Pretty well. And um, I have an, I wanna tell you about an experience I had when I was out with a friend shopping with my locks. Pretty horrific. We'll get into it. Okay, so if you're new, I forgot to give you my intro. If you're new to my videos, you've never seen me before. I'm Wendy. I represent a channel and a lifestyle with locks and we're called Her Locks. This is my channel. And I'm about 17, 16 or 17 months free formed. I don't do any manipulation to my hair. Those of you that know, yeah, this is all done naturally. It's nothing's been predetermined or designed to look a certain way. This is just how my hair has designed, chosen to represent itself naturally. So, um, recently I went shopping with a friend. Well, we went for lunch and then I had to go pick up some knickknacks at Walmart. And um, you know those um, Halloween masks that you get, you've seen in, the, if you've seen the movie, The Purge, they look like one of those. So what does your girl, her looks decide to do? put one on. So I don't remember, I think it was a tiger. They had um, a unicorn. I don't, I'm not into unicorns. Um, I think it was a lion or a tiger. I put this big mask, ball mask on my head and you know, messing around. We had fun. And then come time to take it off, I took it off and then whew, a dust of lint came off with the mask. And then all of us, like two seconds in my head, I said, gosh, this stuff better not be in my hair. <laughs> and when I looked, I got my mirror out. There was gray everywhere. Oh my goodness. Now I was with company, so I had to represent myself as calmly as possible and be act concerned. But inside, your girl was cussing th through the letters of the alphabet. My hair was trapped with lint. And gosh, I did not like it. I was freaking. She tried to help me, but... It wasn't good enough because I still couldn't, you know, I'm in public and you can't pick it yourself the way you do at home. And you know, just a little clause there. Um, so what you, anyway, I got home and um, I was able to pick, pick out my hair and find all the lint that was in there. It was so disgusting. Guys, do not put those things on without putting a plastic cap or something on your head because I don't know how you treat your locks, but for me, it's an extension of me my hygiene, my cleanliness, everything. This is an extension of who I am. So if I don't like dirt and um, my, uh, my parents or my mom, she would say, oh, you know, you, you know, when she sees me picking at them, I, I look like the, uh, the apes and the monkeys that pick at that. You know, I take it as a compliment. I take it as a compliment because you know what? Monkey and ape don't like dirt. The moms clean the babies, the moms clean the husbands, and the babies clean each other. Everyone likes to stay clean. So if you want to call me ape or silverback monkey, I'll take the compliment. Call me a rat now or a lazy cow, we got a problem. So anyway, that was my drama with the Halloween costume thing on my head. Don't do it. I don't advise you put them on without a cap. Cover this first. This comes first. It's not a glamorous thing. I just don't want no crap in here that's not through natural elements. That wasn't a natural element. That was just a dirty mask thing that I shouldn't have put myself in that equation. But anyway, that's good. Now let's get to what's happening up here. Um, I'm going to show you a picture by the way. Yeah, let's do the picture first. Okay guys, so now I'm giving you the rear view of the back of my head. And as you can see, that gap on the right side at the back there, there it is, is still there. Why my head's that way, I don't know. When I tilt my head forward, these are the only locks that come forward. The other ones stay back. This is my left side. It's like a hill there. As you can see the opening. 
feels like a ball patch but it's not and this is my right side more openings feels like ball patches but they're not <laughs> so that's how my hair is looking right now but to what I'm expecting let's go to that so here it is the big reveal what I'm expecting a brand new baby freeform lock I'm so excited see the hook how it's already hooked and curled right there I'm hoping this one here is gonna fill the gap that you see in the back of my hair but who knows what's gonna happen isn't it cute oh my goodness such a special time time Cute! Isn't it cute? I'm expecting a brand new freeform lock is molding right back there. Um, the thing I like about the freeform that if you follow me um, from the beginning and you see now how my hair is molded and how it's changed, that big gap in the middle, if we we're at a baseball game or something and I was sitting probably rows and rows ahead of you or we're in a lineup for somewhere and you saw the back of my head you probably say identify me from my hair and I'd be like I think that's her locks there or I think that's Wendy and they're like how do you know like from my hair you'll know because how my hair has molded itself like back there there was four or five locks originally when I first started but these ones molded together these ones molded together and this one this one no, there, there has to be more than that because one of them, there's like three in there. The other one has two and the other one has two. So there's six locks back there that have now molded into three big ones and left this big space in the back like you saw in the picture. But there is a baby growing <laughs> right there. On my head, I guess it just kind of mat, started to mat on its, on its own. And it's as you can see, it's got the hook thing already formed. So that is what... Her locks is expecting a new brand new baby freeform lock and as you can see I'm really excited about it because I'm not sure in my development how that was going to start happening will I grow more will what I have just stay but as you can see more are growing and as far as my sides this is still open and um, unlocked so that might lock soon well who knows we'll see Okay, so um, I did mention in my previous highlights that I was going to be doing some changes to my channel and to my blog. One of the additions I wanted to do, which I should have done on Friday, but whatever, that's just me, was um, I asked you to send me some questions. And um, thank you, those of you that sent questions. I really appreciate them. So I'm going to start by answering one question on each of the videos that I make from here on at the end of my um, at the end of my content so here goes beautiful sister queen she's got locks she's got a great channel she's got the, <laughs> the best bodies I've seen and she takes such good care from head to toe of herself lockless um, she asked me a question and well she asked me a couple of questions but um, <clears throat> one of them was why did you choose a freeform journey? Um, my reasons for choosing freeform is that unless it's a recipe that I can tweak my way, I don't like to tweak the things that should be natural. Like this plant here, it's meant to be spiky. All I do is water it. I'm not gonna. I, I should prune it, but I'm not. And um, I just want to see what happens if when I ma when I ma maintain what's personally there. And for me, I'm on a natural vibe. I want to know, yes, why our hair is this way. What's its purpose? How strong is it really? Without me touching it, influencing it, or damage whatever I'm doing. I don't know what the hell I'm doing, but what can it do by itself? And as you can see, the results are just amazing. I don't need to do anything to it. It's it's create just like our presence here is um, set for us. I believe the hair clearly. Yes, conditioners and shampoos will keep it clean. Yes, I will keep my hair clean. But for what its purpose for me, it keeps my head warm. It's it looks tough. It looks hard. It looks ugly sometimes. But you know what? 
I think those are things I just put in my head. Because when I walk the street and I'm minding my own business, I hear in the back, oh, I love your hair. Your hair looks great. And I was like, really? People like it. And um, yeah, all I did is keep it moisturized. And that's the way I was made to be natural. I want to see what God's version of me looks like. And you don't like it? Too bad. <laughs> if I don't like it, too bad. This is what it is for a reason. Some of it's beyond our own understanding, like this type of hair, why a certain amount of people only have this hair and the rest of the world, the rest of the nations have a, have the, a similar type of hair, but our hair is unlike any other hair of human on the planet. And am I gonna question? I can't question it now. I won't find the answers now. Am I gonna hate it? That means I have to hate what was made here and can't do that so we'll leave that's why um, that's my belief and um, <clears throat> I'm not gonna push anyone it's not a selling feature for me because this walk isn't for everybody and why I was chosen to do this walk this way I give thanks for that because it's a hard walk to do it really is and those of you that are doing it great but there's my answer to the question hope you enjoyed it hope you enjoyed the show tune in next time and if this is your first time seeing me, follow me on Instagram at Herlocks and subscribe to the channel. And you can um, see more videos of before I was here and how this was before it got to this, this space. Okay? I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like also and let me know that what you're seeing here, what I'm giving out is positive and good. All right? All is love, bless.